Ciao, this is JT Wisdom with Living an Elegant and Graceful Life. And um, you're having a, a maravigli dioso day. Now that's my Italian for you. But that means I hope you're having a wonderful day. Uh, my husband uh, had uh, didn't know he was giving me any perfume or anything like that, but he know I, he knows that I like Floral Street, and Floral Street is an is an English clean fragrance. So it's a, a QVC uh, actually right now it's a QVC clean beauty fragrance, and clean beauty means it doesn't have all those icky. I'm just gonna break it down. It has, doesn't have like those icky chemicals in it and stuff. So it's a it, it's classified as clean beauty you know we want to make sure that things that we put we put on ourselves that that they're the things that aren't you know detrimental but they're things that are are healthy for our skin so um so uh the uh scent that i got that my husband got for me for my for my birthday was black lotus um i had um I had seen them on QVC, uh, maybe about, I had seen the, the brand owner on QVC about, I don't know, maybe three, three, four years ago or something like that. And I got the Neon Rose. The Neon Rose is excellent. I used it to the last drop. And it came, also it came with, um, it was like, came with the perfume and it also came with a, a gift, like a, like a sampler. And so it had a sampler of like 10 or 15 different fragrances that you could choose from. And uh, we went to Colorado for our anniversary last year. So what I, I brought that along so we could kind of just see which other the fragrance that, that we liked. And I really thought that the, and I mean, really, I mean, I like mostly all of them. Uh, but, you know, and one of them was Black Lotus. And Black Lotus it it's it's uh it's uh, added parfum and it's not only is it qvc clean beauty but also the packaging is sustainable as well a completely different kind of packaging because you can see this is how you take it off it and then so as you take it off oh, then there it is that there's floral street this fragrance kind of reminded me of like um you know uh opium you were opium and it was like ooh. It's, you know, it was like opium was a nice fragrance, but it could be, it could be very powerful and you really did not need a lot, but this would be more like the clean, like a clean QVC clean beauty version. This is a clean beauty opium, uh, but it has a hint of woodsiness and spiciness to it. And, uh, but not overpower, not overpowering or blow you over or anything. It's just, and it lasts on me. It lasts all day. You know those kind of fragrances where you don't think you smell it, smell it, but then other people still smell it on you, so it lasts all day. I use maybe like two, two or three sprays, and I spray on. I don't spray on me. I spray on my clothing, or I'll spray on my jacket, or I'll spray on my, you know. But like with this being QVC, this being Clean Beauty, I spray it, you know. But but I usually spray it on my on 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 my clothes most of the time. Uh, and the notes in in this it's an edit parfum so the um, the I guess you could say the description of it says it's a powerful oriental woody perfume complex and multifaceted the sweet honeyed scent of centifolia rose as a depth to a lighter spicy so it's like it's not like it's it's it, rem it gives me that kind of like that inspiration of like it, it's reminiscent of that but it's not it's not overpowering so it's a spicy nuances by the way of um honey scent of centifolia rose as depth of lighter spicy nuances by way of red peppercorn and saffron isn't i mean saffron that's just so um so different to have saffron in a fragrance uh and once enjoyed forever adored and it says, this is a fragrance for the wild, feisty, rebellious, and intoxicating. So, um, uh, and basically, uh, this, you spray it on your wrist, your neck, or your pulse points. And this is actually, this is a 1.7 ounce. It, I actually sprayed it on today. And 
it's just really a it's really a it's a it's it's not a it's not a floral it's a completely different it's not floral it's not it doesn't give off floral sweet it's more it's more deep more warm more woodsy but it's the type of fragrance that i would still i would wear this i would wear this all year long and uh and this is actually the back the back of the bottle too it's like of a a, a deep deep burgundy deep rose in the back and then you can see it says floral street black lotus and i think it's just it's an awesome freight it's a beautiful fragrance a beautiful fragrance and i truthfully can say you know for a while i would say oh i had a signature fragrance but you know you have different moods at least i can say for myself there's different moods there's different times where i may want to wear something something floral something sweet and then there's other times where I maybe want to wear something warm and, and, you know, with that honey in there and the spices and the red peppercorn and the saffron, it's just um, a different kind of, a different kind of vibe. So it just depends on what different kind of mood I may be in. So as far as like saying a signature fragrance, hmm, I really can't really say a signature fragrance. Now I can say certain, certain fragrances that I go back to, but this is one where I would keep this as one to go back to. And also, it's good for you, too. It's it's clean beauty and it's certified cruelty-free. So, um, if you give it a try, and if you do give it a try, let me know. Because uh, I really I really like this fragrance. I, I like a lot of the Floral Street fragrances. So, my husband knows that he can't go, he can't go wrong with this. So, it's, it's just, it's beautiful. And, uh, and... Uh, it's very sweet because I was I really was not expecting a fragrance. I was not so completely caught off guard, but nevertheless, beautiful fragrance. So if you give it a try, let me know, uh, and in the comments, and or if you have it, let me know. That'd be great. So until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day. Uh, remember to be elegant, be graceful, be bold, be you. And remember that God is for you. And remember that Jesus loves you. This is JT Wisdom.